Okay, y'all, so usually we do not try, um, when we're out of town, we don't try restaurants that we already have in the States or in that area, but we are in Abu Dhabi and we want to try the McDonald's here because it's actually prepared um, totally different than the U.S. McDonald's. So my husband's gonna try uh, a couple meals, not a couple meals, he's gonna try a meal and I'm gonna taste a little bit and see how different it really is. for cheeseburger fries. Right, Russ. So this is the burger. That's about the same, but they said it's prepared differently for the custom over here. These are the fries. The fries are good. They taste about the same though. They might be real over here. We don't know. Sadly, I thought I was recording my review and I wasn't so. My overall experience was that the burger to me tastes a little better than the U.S. burger. It was salty, but we had been on a diet previously with almost no salt that could have been my taste buds. The fries were good, but not a big difference in taste, but there is a big difference. In preparation of the burgers in the way versus the USA, in the way, McDonald's meat patties are produced from 100% pure halo beef with no additives, preservatives, or flavor enhancers. The beef patties are prepared and packaged at McDonald's approved meat plants, in addition to inspections carried out before the beef arrives. At the plants, the suppliers undertake several separate quality checks on every batch. All beef is grilled to perfection, without the addition of fats or oils on a double-sided hot plate. They make sure that the specified temperature is maintained during the whole beef grilling process to ensure safety while guaranteeing juicy tasty. Patties. The fries do not have any fillers, preservatives, or additives, and very different from the U.S. standards. All right, it's your girl, the real Gina B. Date with the plate. Only eat it if it's good.